In Ghana, many people seem to have much confidence in orthodox medicines as against plants or natural products. Despite this trust in orthodox drugs, many non-curable infectious diseases still exist as they are unable to treat them. Also, there are instances where germs such as bacteria and fungi develop the ability to defeat the drugs designed to kill them, which researchers term as antimicrobial resistance. While researchers across the world are struggling to find an antidote to this, a renowned Ghanaian scholar, Professor Christian Ejari, says plants and other natural products could be the game changer if policymakers embrace it. Plants and other natural products do offer some hope in reducing antimicrobial resistance as well as non-curable infectious diseases. They must therefore be embraced and further explored if we desire to win this battle. However, we must be on the side of caution and also intensify public education to curb the unrestrained use of drugs, be it natural products or octodos, in the management of infections since we do not know the dangers associated with this chemotherapeutic use. Professor Christian Ajari, who is also the provost of College of Health Sciences at KNUST, made this statement at his professorial inaugural lecture, where he highlighted some major findings in his researches that stakeholders can take advantage of. He is thus also advocating for the country to have a well-defined policy direction and intensify the antimicrobial stewardship agenda. In this regard, is urging regulatory bodies to intensify surveillance to ensure antimicrobial products on the market are of the required standard and are properly handled, prescribed, and used by all relevant stakeholders. Also, I strongly believe Ghana needs to have a well-defined policy direction and intensify the antimicrobial stewardship agenda. Furthermore, regulatory bodies must intensify surveillance to ensure that antimicrobial products on the market are of the required standard and are properly handled, prescribed, and used by all relevant stakeholders, including Food and Drugs Authority, Ghana, Pharmacy Council, pharmaceutical manufacturers and importers, distributors, clinicians, prescribers, pharmacists, technicians, pharmacists, etc. Professor Christian Ajari also wants policies to be formulated to incorporate some standardized herbal creams and ointments to be prescribed at health facilities. Plant and plant products or phytochemicals have been ordained for healing cell creation. Their rational application can be key in the management of mass infirmities. Plants therefore hold a place in our fight against infections and antimicrobial resistance menace. Therefore, I call on individuals, researchers, healthcare regulators, health professionals, and policy makers engage in this fight to have a strategic look at the role of ethnic medicine in healthcare delivery.